Hello everyone, this is For the King and we are back. Um, I guess last time we kind of defeated the glittering uh, mines and all that, and we apparently, yeah, I, I kind of don't really know how to say this. So, um, I guess it was a bit logical. Well, the game is not all just to go and defeat the glittering mines. It seems it has multiple levels, which I must say didn't really quite expect. I thought it was just like one mission and a lot of other stuff around, like. Because we discovered a lot, of that, a lot of stuff, and I'm actually really bummed out that we uh, at least I don't consider we have enough time to go and investigate all of this. Because I would have enjoyed a lot to investigate all of this, even in, even uh, and go and I don't know level up and I guess farm a lot of these mobs and events and so on and so forth, or get killed. <laughs> Probably the last one, but nevertheless. So um. We're gonna kind of let all of this behind because now we are at um, not a crossroad, but we are upon another quest that the game kind of offered us. We need to investigate uh, if this would actually move for faster all the way over here. It's probably gonna be like a body of water between um, these things, or this is maybe an island. There is this thing here which says purchase or repair ocean vessel. So if we have enough money, which I I don't even know if we do have, well, we do have a bit of money, but. I don't quite know how you can transfer all this to buy a vessel, and I don't know how much it costs, so keep that in mind, I guess. So, um, I kind of deviate, I think. So, we started with the idea that uh, there was, like, only one quest. You do that, and you're pretty much well done, and that's the game. Uh, if you want to, you kind of repeat it, and over and over again, or explore different stuff, and so on and so forth. I was hoping that after the quest, you kind of would be left to do whatever you wish within the world, you know? Um, and I, oh, I guess I always fought this because, well, uh, the game is kind of new and I didn't know how much development went into it. Now, we are with Bandai right now, so we're going to move over here to investigate a bit further, I guess, uh, the realm. I do have one more movement. Oh, and we actually can get another vessel from here as well. Now, I have no clue... Uh, how f uh, if I guess the water from here connects to that island over there or whatever, so I'm not gonna do that. This is a level two engaging dire wolf. Now this is something I kind of want to do. You can't really seem to be able to pass through here. I think I would kind of incline. I would be inclined to go that way, but I suppose we're just gonna stay closer to Woodstock over here, and that's it. Now Andorra, she can move a lot apparently. Click to continue four spaces it's about just about right I don't want to engage this one with just one guy I want all of them nearby uh, also uh, what is it oh actually Andorra is the one Andorra really really needs to go to here because she's gonna get some experience which we don't necessarily care that much about at this point to be honest I think four hammer would have profited more from that so it would have uh, she would have been way much closer to leveling up then again, doesn't quite matter, but Andorra is kind of really weak, because she only have about 13 life. So that will pretty much uh, propel her a bit further towards the leveling up and refilling her entire life. So I don't have to rest and lose a turn with her. Um, so I'm going to try to go with her directly over here. Apparently I'm not going to be able to. Okay, she is inspired. Oh, crap. I guess uh, daytime kind of passed. Actually, that was night time. Now we're in the day. We have four movement with the uh, foe hammer. I still want Andorra to get this, so I don't know how we're gonna go about it. I don't really want to engage this, but I don't think I kind of have a choice about now. So there's like two of them. That's really bad. One of these appeared as well. We're not doing too great. I think the safest path would have been like going through here, and probably this would connect somehow. I don't think we can pass over this. I'm pretty sure of it, actually. So, I'm a, in a bit of a, I don't know, jam or something. Why do we want Andorra to go here? I kind of forgot to say. Because it says full focus and she has like none. That would help out a bit as well. I guess I'm going to try to have to ambush this one. Hope for the best. Because I don't think we can withstand two of these guys. I have no clue what they do, give or whatever. Day two already. We have about 20 days, I think, or so. No, 24 rounds to actually get to that uh, lighthouse or whatever that is. I guess we could have went like on the other way. Oh my god, this is a dragon. This is a level 3 dragon. Okay, and there's like another band of level 2. I really want to fight like all of them, but because of this rounds, uh, 
I guess I felt I feel compelled just to um, uh, m move towards the goal of the game more than anything else. We're probably gonna die anyways, cause like we're on the first playthrough. Oh my god! So we would actually, if I engage this right now and we don't pull an ambush, we're gonna fight like three guys, a minotaur, or whatever that is, beast something. Can't really quite see. Uh, forest troll and another forest troll over here. They're all level two. Uh, and I have one character which is really weak right now, so this kind of sucks like a lot. Okay, there's a birdie over here which we're gonna engage if we fight this though. But this actually may prove to be the longer path, but the better path, so we can actually even level up. So I kind of don't really know how to go about it. I suppose I could come with full hammer this way. I guess I can and not engage this one. Don't quite know. Let's see, can we? No, we're gonna go right past through that one. Oh crap. So, another mob just appeared and we're kinda screwed. We're gonna fight like four of them. I don't know if we can actually pull a fight with them. I have never fought one of these before. We could try to uh, ambush. Unfortunately, there's only like a, a three success, otherwise, it's just failure. I could go with two focus. And uh, hope for the best. And actually succeeded. That's kind of really good. We're only going to fight like one with all three of our guys. Wow. He has like 36 life. And four armor. So this is uh, kind of bad, I guess. Oh, well. So four hammer goes first. Uh, I haven't played the game for a while. So I don't really quite remember all the things we do. So ignore armor. 31 chance. And this is basically the same attack. But... Uh, just a standard attack and this is leave. So we're gonna go with snipe and hope for the best. Ooh, nice! That's like an 8 damage. It's about his turn. He went for full hammer because, well, why wouldn't he? I didn't really quite see for how much he actually hit. But my god, are we low on health. And we can really... We could daze. We could try a daze, which maybe not be that of a bad of an idea. Oh, as a bad of an idea. But he is immune to stun, so... Eh, that's kind of sucks. We can make a perfect rush. That's a chance. Um, actually, actually just, just going to boost uh, our speed in the combat. We're going to go with this, hopefully, and hope for the best. Well, we're going to do some damage at least. And I guess it's like the only thing we could do. And that's a 30 hit and kill. Hopefully we level up. I don't know how much experience we're going to get. Six experience. Not enough, but close enough. We should be able to move some more right now. Now, I don't only want to go there, but I kind of want to go all the way there. And why not energy boost? One more movement. We could engage this. We only fight this two because we don't have any more focus. But I'm going to skip his turn. I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to have to come with all my guys back. He didn't regenerate, which is kind of neat. Okay, click there. Go all the way over here. And then access this. Uh, play tribute, whatever that means. You stand before a weathered monument. Okay. <laughs> uh, we're gonna have. Okay, does this like lure? Pay tribute. Twelve experience. Unknown hero of uh, Fakhrul. One day your deeds will be celebrated as well, hero. So you get full focus and experience. I don't think we'll level up though. Now we're kind of close too, but not fully leveled up. And we can still move a tad, so that's kind of something, I guess. Uh, this... Oh, or we can't. Uh, actually, we can, but... Oh, we are inspired, which gives some experience. Very nice. Uh, for him, we can actually move up to six slots, if we're lucky. We're not, though. So I guess I'm going to move over here. And then over here. And I think that's about it. So now it's Bantai's turn again. We kind of spend a few turns over here, but uh, you can't help it. I, we could have went through all of these guys. I mean, this was pretty tough by itself because it hit hit a lot. And we don't... I, I just want to level up, you know. That would be the main goal. Uh, we do have Andor over here, which you could try to pull maybe uh, an ambush, but I don't think we can. So we're going to... Oh, crap. It's like another mob there. Let's hope for the best. Uh, we can... We could try a sneak, but I don't kind of want to. I'm just going to go for an ambush, you know, and maybe I get lucky. I don't think so, but... Oh my god, we actually were lucky. We 
at least one guy should level up uh, for hammer, so she's gonna recover some of her health. And we need to protect Andorra as much as we can. She's our musical uh, guy, so I guess we're gonna go with this again. It doesn't have that much. Oh wow. Well, he did dodge it. And that's not good at all. She's actually dead. It was kind of awful. Oh well. All, all is good in war, I guess. Wow, we're really bad shots against this guy. Hopefully this is gonna work, and it worked, and we're kinda saved. Fogammer should level up, and Dora's gonna get like nothing, apparently. Using this herb will replenish some health. Oh great, cause we're gonna need it on Andorra. I guess, I don't know, collect? On who, on Bantai? Uh, I guess I'm gonna use it directly. There we go, that actually replenished us. So, we leveled up Bantai now. Uh, not Bantai, for Hammer. Bantai is quite close, so maybe this birdie would help out overall. Uh, I don't think Bantai can move anymore, by the way. Or can he? Oh, she, he can still move. I don't want to go into another fight, though. Wow, what, what's that? Level... Oh, we level up because we discovered something. A cave or something. So, this is our queen. Uh, the mysteries of uh, Fakhrul are seemingly endless. You have stumbled upon a dark cave. Great, because we're not going to go in it, because we only have a certain amount of rounds to do, well, I guess her bidding or something. Now, I don't really want to go this way. I really want to just fight this thing and just move uh, towards Parrot. Uh, maybe it would have been smarter to go that way, I guess. I don't know. I guess we could retreat a bit, but I don't see... Yeah, we're going to retreat a, a, a tad. One more wound. I guess we're going to retreat even more. Center of wealth crumbled. Bah, whatever that is. Respawn Andorra in uh, town, but lose 30 experience. Or we could just come with one of our heroes and just, uh, I guess, get to her. Because town would mean Woodstock. Or even worse, uh, all the way back here somewhere. Where's that town? Orton. That's gonna be like a few turns until she can reach, so no. I'm gonna say no. And we're gonna put four hammer over here to revive uh, Andorra. Revive Andorra! We need more health, by the way, uh, than we initially had. We can still move, which is quite great. Ah, crap, not again. What's the matter with these guys? They really pop up, like, everywhere. Now, we do have enough to go for an ambush, so I'm just gonna put everything on four hammer for an ambush, unfortunately. This should prove actually quite helpful. Andorra may be close. Uh, she's gonna get like only a six uh, experience, as I recall. So, oh well. Let's go for full damage. Hopefully, it's gonna work out. And we kind of missed the block. That's not good, cause we would have killed it without like any problems at all. There we go. That would have been dead right now. He's immune to stun, which is kind of awful. Like a lot of awful. Uh, well, we did a bit of damage, not that it would actually matter. Let's see who he's going to target. Wow, that that hurt like really bad. Fortunately, there's like no effect. I have no idea what this is. Uh, did he like uh, the disarmor us or something? Yeah, we don't seem to have a weapon anymore. It's probably on the ground? I don't know. Get random weapon uh, from backpack. Yeah, do that. I guess we got something there. And we're gonna have to trim this guy down slowly, apparently. This is not necessarily good. Wow. Hopefully nobody's gonna die again. I guess we're getting to the... Oh, do miss a little. For gas. Wow, we're gonna have to recover anyways. Hopefully we're actually gonna get to town. So a stun is not gonna work at all. I guess we're gonna go with a smash. Whatever that's gonna do. Only a 3 damage. I do wonder where my weapon is. I hope, uh, hopefully I didn't lose it. Finally. Some decent shots. Uh, still our turn. Yep, let's hope we at least hit with one. And he's done for. There we go. Let's get some gold. And only, oh, eight and six experience. I guess some of our guys actually uh, got a bit more experience than normally or something. Uh, but I can move a lot, but I still want to kind of investigate and figure out what's going on with um, our inventory and why does did Andorra uh, oh no actually was I think four hammer had the very good um, yeah I don't care about that go away 
No. Oh, so I can only go through inventories when I'm actually on that uh, target? I thought it was... Uh, I kind of forgot how you go into inventory, to be honest. I don't know. This button? No. Maybe this button? This button? No. Apparently that ain't it. Ain't it. So, I don't know how much life these things have. Apparently, if we do not pull a, a good ambush, we're kind of screwed. But, on the other hand, we're not going to fight with three guys, which is not necessarily that good. Especially since we don't have that uh, uh, OP weapon that we used to have. And we're probably going to get another mob in our way around this part. So unfortunately, like it or not, I'm gonna have to lose like another turn over here. At least we recovered some health back. You kind of recover with him uh, as much health as you don't move. Something along those lines. Now Andorra can really move right now. So she could actually engage. Yeah, let's try it like this. Let's see if it actually works, to be honest. And let's try an ambush. It's only... Well, let's actually do a full tree. We're gonna go like this. I don't wanna fight more than I need to. It's only a 16, so and it's immune to burning, so we could really stun her, actually. We don't have that big of a chance, and she is like the last one to go. So if we do enough damage, we should kill it without really her or it doing any damage to us. Apparently that's not the case. She seems to have come a bit faster to shoot. I don't even know why, to be honest. Because I'm going to go with focus, and that should be about it. There we go. Five experience, hopefully. Uh, just about a two and a three, and we got another herb, herb or whatever. Uh, using this herb makes the user undetectable. Yeah, we're just gonna collect it. Come on, get out! There we go. Can we move some more? Yes, we can. Ooh, game of cards. Uh, a card sharp eye. Eyes? What? A card sharp eyes you from beneath the rim of his hat if you're the if you've got if you've got basically the coin I have a very interesting wage for you so let's see uh, on three successes you get 16 gold don't quite care because we have like a ton already eight gold for two nothing or lose all gold oh uh, I think I'm gonna go with end turn because to be fair oh come on we're gonna get like one at least there we go we actually got eight gold uh, I had the, the guts to actually do it, because I was inclined to just go away, to be honest. Uh, what in God's name is this? Only three movement with four hammer? Test yourself. Good fishing spot. Yeah, we're not going to do that. We want to move towards the home more than anything else. So I don't... Oh, actually, we do want to investigate... Uh, the... Um, I don't see any weapons on the ground. Can't really say I see any external weapons in my backpack either. So what we have right now is a 13 damage. This is just a 10, so it's actually better. Quarter staff, we don't quite care. But where in God's name is the great that great weapon that we had that did like a 30 damage or so? I'm guessing you can you're going to lose it upon death or something. Or am I looking at the wrong character? I kind of remember sh uh, Fallhammer had it. Andor is the loot guy, uh, girl, so she doesn't loot anything. Okay, this is a tad weird, I guess, overall. What does she have, by the way? Like, really? Oh, no. That's over here. So, use a herb while traveling to gain additional action points. Use it in combat to increase attack speed. Also to instantly travel to any visited land, and this is uh, one of the camps. So I guess we're gonna move. Oh my God! Not again! So we're gonna fight like all of these guys. My God, that's like a lot. And I have absolutely no more ambush, no more focus to go. So this may actually prove to be a wipe. I don't know. I guess we're gonna try it anyways. We could go directly uh, and fight. Or we could try it for a retreat. I guess we could go for an... Ah, we're gonna go with an ambush and hope for the best. Crap, we really failed. Like, we failed. That was like the worst fail ever, too. And they also go first. Luckily, we actually managed to dodge that one. We got nothing in the damage there. Another 8 on us. We're really not looking that good. 
We have a lot of mobs with a lot of life. Oh my god, this has like a 70 and we don't have the 30 damage weapon. So I kind of can say already that we're kind of screwed. <laughs> so this is a 60. He does a lot of damage too. So I guess I'm going to go on him first. Okay. That seemed to go like just about fine. Nobody... Oh, actually this guy is immune to stun. Oh, great. Exactly what we wanted. Let's try to at least kill this one. The turn is not going to be that way, but he's going to go close enough. Ah, uh, let's go like this. Yeah, at least we kill like one of them. That's going to be something, supposedly. And we got a critical, because how else? And there's only two more. Oh my god. This like really sucks. We're going to have some deaths upon us. I really wished we wouldn't really die and we could actually continue. Whoa, he actually hits two of them. Okay, like really go away. At least we're gonna kill two. That's my hope. I could try to stun, but I also could try to kill. There we go. I only have like one more to contend with, but I don't think we have enough life to pull like anything really off. I mean, it is a goddamn 60 for God's sake, and he's immune to stun, so that really, really sucks. Luckily, we're pulling some perfect shots, but and I do think he. Only hits to a decent tile, so he's gonna go for one of them and probably kill one. Uh, if my math is right, we're never gonna be able to kill this one either way. But oh well, what can you do? And he's really going on a perfect. Wow, we actually dodge. That may actually give us a chance overall. If he doesn't retaliate too too fast, what can we do? Use around. So I think the uh, herb relieves the effect of poison. Makes this undetectable, I don't quite care about that. And this one? What does this one do? Why aren't you actually showing me what this one does? Because we're not on him, we're on full hammer, which seems to be dead. And he can shoot? Oh, well. Uh, probably that wasn't it. So, the... Boost to evasion. We're gonna, we're gonna need it. But I'm gonna go with damage right now, as much as I can. Wow, nice. We're kind of close, but we're still kind of in real danger. We may be able to pull this one off, actually. Wow. This is like one life. One of them is going to die right now. He actually got like a min... Ooh, we're with two life and still hanging. We're going to level up, which is awesome. Unfortunately, uh, four hammer won't. So, only one damage now. And it's actually perfect. This one got killed, like, really bad. Victory! We got some armor, which is not bad at all. We also uh, leveled up. We're level 3 with Andorra and right now, so I think everybody's level 3. So let's see, this armor resistance, minus, tough, minus toughness though, and some fortitude. I have like, no, let's see, equip. I guess I just could collect it. Okay, so she has like no boots at all. It will lower her... Wait a minute, there was some... Uh, button around here. No, not this one. That was showing me the stats. I do want to see my stats. Yeah, I get the revision and resistance. How can I see my stats? I want to see my stats, because otherwise I don't quite know if this is good or not. Uh, well, apparently, like it or not, she has, like, no boots at all, so I'm just going to equip it on her. Uh, again, this herb... Uh, I guess I could... They both have it, except for her, which... Uh, for, for Hopeful Hammer, which is that. I guess I'm gonna give it to him. And that apparently seems to be about it. Oh, well. Now the Sanctum crumbled for some reason. Okay. We do have this, which we could fight. We don't have that much focus. Uh, but to be honest, I just want to, like revive my uh, fallen uh, comrade over here. We got back some HP, I suppose. And we should just stay put, to be fair, so we could recover some health. If I go into my inventory, I don't. we don't really quite have that much. I'm really regretting that 30 damage sword. I don't know what happened. I guess upon death you lose it. I don't really even remember if we died with full hammer for that matter, but apparently we did. Let's end the turn here and recover at least one point of health, because we should manage to get there. And I don't really want to move just in case someone like jumps on us or anything. 
Uh, I suppose we could go this way. Okay, uneventful, which is kind of weird. <laughs> Usually something happens and kind of kicks you in the balls. Okay, move there first. Crap, see? Told you. Some, some shit always happens. But we can ambush it. And hope for the best. Yeah, uh, let's go with full focus, because I don't see any other way to go about it. I really don't want to risk it, you know, and just roll. So he is immune to stun. We're just gonna go with a normal bash, and hope for the best. Ah, well, there's gonna be some damage, I guess. So, oh my god, I'm really a bad roller with this one. And we're actually even blocking. Because, yeah, we do that, it seems. Oh, he's gonna kick our ass. Probably not a wipe because of full hammer, but we're gonna get another kill, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure about that. Especially when I roll like this. We were very lucky with the rolls on that troll thingy. Wow, only two damage, like really? Oh well, at least we're gonna get some more damage apparently from full hammer. And he's dead, because how else? Hopefully we kill it though. Yeah, this should be the part to do it. There we go. We're gonna get, get it some experience. Oh, actually we got the weapon, which is actually all not that bad. So it's actually better than what Full Hammer has right now. I'm just gonna equip it. This gives stun, this just gives armor. Oh armor pierce. And plus two armor. I kinda don't wanna lose the stun, but to be honest. We're kind of um, facing a lot of mobs, which seems to be resistant to stun. So that's not good. Okay, go back and revive this uh, this guy, because he kind of needs it. Okay, uh, at least he got back his focus. And you can move some more? Okay, that's something, I suppose. Everything appears normal, yet things could change rapidly for the worse. Uh, pray... Okay, so we got one kill, so one of those. Pray go about your quest. Okay, great. One chaos more than we want to or need. I'm, I'm walking like one tile at a time, just to be sure. So we actually uh, reached our quest. We needed to go to uh, Parrot. Welcome to Parrot. I'm uh, Drea Palor, Queen's uh, Rosomons, uh, or something, Prime Agent in this, uh, in this um, Trouble Times. And uh, that fell tower is uh, Harazul, the thing that we actually need to get to. A cursed place and a source of chaos. It is protected by a shield which we need to bring down. I know a way. Uh, seek the key fragment at this location. Oh, great. Complete the subjects uh, in any order. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna have to get some key fragments, which is not necessarily good. So we're gonna have to kill this guy, which seems to be. Surrounded by a lot of mobs, kill the mind bender in the golden plains. Great. Oh my god, this is like so far away. Purge a uh, leech crypt in the rogue island. Oh great. Oh, don't tell me I'm gonna have to go back all the way, all the way over here. Find and solve the forgotten cellar in the burning forest. Complete these objects in any order. Really? Ha. <sighs> I'm just not even gonna comment. We're pretty much done for. <laughs> We're so frail as we are right now. Uh, we lost our greatest uh, ace, which was the 30 damage weapon. Uh, I don't even know how we lost it. Probably it just disappears upon death or something. Or maybe you always uh, lose upon death your um, your weapon. I don't know. Uh, or maybe it was like destroyed by uh, the Minotaur. I, I just don't know. I don't know the game well enough to actually um, get these things, to be honest. We made a pretty long video as it is, so we're just going to end, end it over here. So with that being said, if you enjoyed the clip, give it a big like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And I'm going to see you guys and gals around next time.